Welcome to the Pluto Lounge, where we just chill. All these telltale signs of dark justicias that we've been seeing, I'm having a hard time believing they're a coincidence. It could be nothing, all the same. Lands like these must have seen all sorts throughout the years. Still, there may be more to it. I need to keep alert, in case that suspicion amounts to anything. Coincidence is more common than destiny, in my experience. Don't get your hopes up. Still, there may be more to it. I need to keep alert, in case that suspicion amounts to anything. Uh, I guess I was just a little bit bugged. Dialogue. <laughs> Did they really move Kaga's body, like, out here? Because we killed her in there, but like... <laughs> They just put her body here to leave a message. I don't know, maybe it's Druids. They want the, the body to decay here. To give back to the land, I guess. You know, the circle of life. <laughs> that is interesting, though. Alright, let's go kill some goblins. We need to finish up and clear clear it all out. Oh, the Blighted Village still isn't aggroed. I guess that's cool. I don't really have any need to kill all of them. What have we got here? Oh, stop this thing! The goblin seems unsure whether to bow to you or attack. What, what do you want? Or, oh, I, I mean, uh, what do you need? An explanation. Tell me what you're doing with that deep gnome at once. Um, y you are blessed, ain't ya? A true soul! As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. <laughs> um, pardon, sir. Didn't mean to doubt you. I know my place. Well, that, that's that. We'll be on our way. Do as you like with the pipsqueak. The goblins slink backwards, afraid to take their eyes off you. Stop. I have questions. Uh, ask the pipsqueak on the spinny tower. We're out of here. All right, then. Fresh meats. Scared meats. Yes. Uh. Shadowheart's attention is fixed on a damaged old statue. We... we should keep moving. Another episode? Why does this keep happening to you? You already know as much as I do. Best ignore it. As long as it doesn't hamper us too much. What's in it for me? Free me and find out! Oh, Baga Kamara. There's pustulant thugs! Well, get on with it. I freed you. A little compensation would be nice. Compensation? Was that all? Well, I expected worse from the likes of you. Take my pack. If you can find it. The only reason those goblins caught me was its weight. I'll travel lightly from now on. You're a little far from home for a deep gnome. Ignorance is alive and well, it seems. Deep gnomes aren't restricted to the Underdark, you know. I've lived in Baldur's Gate for years. I'm in search of a friend. I fear he's in trouble. See this? I gave it to him years ago before I left home. I found it around the neck of a thug in the lower city. It was speckled with blood. My friend, nowhere to be found. But I still have hope. 
I have reason to believe he's in the Underdark. Hopefully, I'll pick up his trail from there. I always help my friends. On that note, <clears throat> I bid thee farewell. If we should meet again, well, we will have met again. Hmm. Well, you're welcome. What the hell? What the hell is going on in here? Approach a guttural scream and a succession of quick bangs rattle the door. Then a low moan. Someone or something is having a bit of fun. Ah, oh, well, you know, let them do their thing. So where the hell are we? Uh, don't tell me we're about to fight a big old spider. Ah, there they are. Oh, there's a web here. <laughs> I did not even see that. Oh, it can teleport? That's pretty cool. In my best interest. And there. Damn, only 45%. Um, I guess we get... We'll do the sword. And then... Bless him so that we can get the... Uh... to attack roll bonus. Damn, those are some clutch dodges.
Alright. Damn, still 55%. Guess we need to turn this off. Lazo's got hops. Which means I get a bonus roll. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, I guess I figured. I guess the potion was my. Ooh, that's rough. percent what the hell path is interrupted by what taking position like why is our hit percentage so high I think I gotta play this a little bit more aggressively. I wonder what spiders are weak to. I would assume fire. Maybe not. Life comes easy these days. Ooh, eighty percent. Killed me? Making my move. Let's do this. 
Uh, that's unfortunate. Alright, these teleporting spiders are freaking obnoxious. Why does the spellcasting always delay like that? I can't even catch my breath. What path lies before me? We got one down. Time to push my luck again. Get that crit. Nice. Have to keep going. Gosh, this place is huge. Hmm. Looks like it's only one dude. Yeah, I think we should be all right. Famous last words. <laughs> Let's do it. Hopefully there's no surprises. Like, all right, spiders start hatching from these eggs, man. <laughs> That's a whole different story. All right, time to skulk about. Never wanted these. Okay, there's another one. 
Where the hell did he come from? Oh no. No. Why is it hatching eggs? Why is it so big? Wait, matriarch? Enemies in honor mode. Important enemies that your adventure will be more powerful in honor mode. Okay. 162 life points. All right, guys. Well, um, that was my honor run. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. But uh, our Baldur's Gate run ends here. Um, it was a fun time. I mean, I think we progressed through Act 1 pretty good. I know there's two more acts, but we'll just act like those don't exist. But, um, you know, I'll try to make this a good fight, <laughs> I guess, to end this off well. But, um, yeah, yeah. Um, we shall see. All right, for starters, I don't really want to be grouped up. Don't be holding back your love. Shoot, what should I even do with you, Will? Um, actually, okay. Well, let's just get you into the attacking position. And then we will use armor of Agathis. Ascend. Ascend to what? Alright, and let's give you your fantastic jumping ability. Damn, she's got hops. We'll end it there. Damn these teleporting spiders. So annoying. Need to find a way forward. Uh, don't quite want to attack yet. Let's use our sword ability. And then Wait, where's our bonus action? Why don't I have a bonus action? Oh, because I started the last one? Alright, whatever. Let's play some music. Even little baby spiders can teleport too. What's going on? React to your next attacker with flames. I deal 3 to 30 damage. Deals an additional 1 to 2 damage per level. Sure. Oh my gosh, this camera. Alright, you should be okay. Let's get these spiders out of the way. No holding back. No holding back. 16%. It's rough. And these disadvantages are terrible. Finding my way. Time to strike. Mm. Let's, let's get these little things out of the way. Okay, the camera like on multiple levels gets rough. Time to press ahead. Man, I hate having to chase these things around, man. <laughs> oh, 40%.
Oh, come on. My gosh, that's ridiculous. Like if I can kill these guys first, that would be really, really nice. Victory awaits. things so much. Why is Fairy Fire such a low chance to hit? Is it because they have high dexterity? Here. Go to sleep. Back to back crits, are you kidding me? You will not take me. Great. I really wish I would have long rested. the mood. Damn, they need to roll an 18 to do damage. Roll with that. Oh my gosh, Lazel is just permanently stuck. But at least she went Ultra Instinct. Death.
Oh, this is so awkward. Got you, Lazo. Alright, let's ease the tension. I could rather save my shield for like the um, the bigger guys. Is rough. Damn, that was a lot of damage. That's great. What 
Action Learn. Seriously, I know just what to do. Time to waste. Can he miss one attack? Is that too much to ask? Okay, can we get a counter attack going? The battle favors the fearless. Two steps at a time. So I'll take a crit. Ooh, we're hanging on. But I've consumed like most of my items. I'm curious to see what happens if I take that, that net that he's standing on. Two steps at a time. Ooh, 56 damage. I'll take it. Guys, we, we might just win this. <laughs>
One day I'll catch a break. But he's laid down. I still only have a 60% chance to win. To hit. Like it's prone. And threatened. Like shouldn't I have a higher percentage to hit? That's like the mechanics that I just don't quite understand. Why am I not getting a bonus for that? We got the hit. Play some music. Ooh, good miss, baby. Good miss. Alright, let's just try to get as much damage as we can. that right here oh that's not a bonus action lame I'm not sure if that will work worth a try no it doesn't work it doesn't work Time to waste. Ah, oh, Lazel, I needed that hit. Survival is all that matters. I would, uh, damn, fifty percent. Fifty percent. Is it because there's no light? You're listening. No, I'm trust. I should be able to see in the dark. Oh, why is my hit chance so low? Whatever. Oh, we hit. Another nice dodge. Shot of heart. Ah, no clutch today. Okay. It's all on you, Lazel. Ah, oh, we did it. <laughs> we did it. Oh my gosh, I did not think we were going to beat this guy. But we somehow managed to do it. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> score one for the big guy. Oh yeah. You carry a Githyanki relic. I will have an explanation. Or your head. Walk away. Now. I won't warn you again. Relic? This is about that artifact, isn't it? That artifact is an heirloom of my people. Likely she spilled Githyanki blood in order to steal it. This cannot stand. Heirloom? Plunder from some conquered realm, more like. This artifact is the only thing keeping us from becoming slaves to our parasites. Be glad I have it. So, any ideas on how we can settle this? The bad blood must be purged. A jewel come first light. You mean I'd get to prove you wrong and thrash you? I love it. Get some rest, Lazel. You'll need it. You had every chance to look the other way. But here we are. You chose this. Spare me the justifications, coward. If anyone asks, I'll say you were transforming. Don't expect to be mourned. Shadowheart, stop. You don't have to do this. A liability. It's the artifact we need, not her. Let me up, and I'll show you. We need her, Shadow Heart. Give her a chance. Can I do that, Lazel? Can I turn my back on you? Never. 
Thieves aren't afforded such luxury. Loosen the grip on your pride for one blasted moment, won't you? We needn't be enemies. There's plenty of those to go around already. What would you have? That we be friends? Let's not get ahead of ourselves. But imagine what we might achieve if we channeled some of that hostility back at our real foes, instead of each other. They wouldn't stand a chance. I want to talk about what happened with Lazelle. We aren't dear friends now, if that's what you're asking. But I trust we can all sleep a little more soundly in camp now. <laughs> you to talk. That's good. I'd rather keep things friendly between all of us. You have an interesting definition of friendly, but yes. <laughs> Again, you to talk. Speak. About your quarrel with Shadowheart. It is over where I am concerned. That's a relief. We won't survive this if we don't stand together. It is through conflict that we strengthen our bonds. Yet I do not recommend Shadowheart seek it again. The next resolution may not end in her favor. I hope that's the end of this silly quarrel. They'll have no energy for battling our enemies if Lazel and Shadowheart are too busy squabbling among themselves. Oh, I really thought Shadowheart and Lazel might fight to the death over that artifact. A pity. It would have made for a fine night's entertainment. I'll say one thing for our troop. We're not short on drama. I'm glad Shadowheart and Lazel settled their differences peacefully. Eventually. There's something I want to talk to you about. Something important. Well now, I'm intrigued. Do continue. I could have died in that pod, back on the Nautiloid. You could have died, spending precious moments trying to free me, but you did it anyway. I owe you my life. Twice over, in fact. You supported me against Lazel. I may not have survived that night without you. I'm trying to say that you've earned my trust in a way very few ever have. I want that to mean something. I want you to know more about me, at least from what I can remember. As long as I've prayed to Lady Shah, I've wished to serve her as a dark justicia. There is scarcely a greater way to fully dedicate yourself to Lady Shah, save perhaps if you become the head of her church. To become a Dark Justicia is to become the Night Singer's sword arm, her implement with which she will cast down the unbelievers and win the final battle to restore her perfect, endless darkness. It's all I ever wanted. I prayed it was my calling. But Mother, forbid me from seeking to prove myself worthy of the rank. She said I was not ready. Not my mother mother, I should add. The mother superior, head of Lady Shah's enclave in Baldur's Gate. Sometimes I wonder if she would ever deem me ready. I owe her everything, and I only wish to serve, yet she can prove inscrutable I don't understand why be so secret about such an ambition dark justiciers are hated by many judged to be ruthless fanatics even the few who would accept a follower of Lady Shah would likely balk at a justicia in their midst but there's a simpler answer to your question I simply forgot about the desire I had until I saw some things that reminded me now I can't get it out of my mind. Do you think she'll ever relent and make you a dark justiciar? I don't know. Perhaps if I succeed in my mission and reach Baldur's Gate. Hope has little place amongst Lady Shah's children. It's an illusion. A distraction. But for this... 
I hope my time will yet come. Thank you for sharing. Broken bones. No. Must have fallen. Why would I bury a weapon? Is it broken? It's a metaphor. I do not know your metaphor. But if you need help digging, I will find a shovel. <laughs> okay, where the hell are we? Hey, it's a Minotaur. Two Minotaurs. Damn, these guys have so much freaking... Alright, I guess we're fighting it. Okay, we'll hex it for strength. Brutal leap and a charge. Oh boy. Let's try to take out one at least. No, can't even do that. My injuries need tending. Yeah. Working on it. Time to flourish. Ooh, 94%. Let's turn that on, baby. Let me do this. Damn, we missed one of them. that works. Let's take out one first.
tough mess. Uh, 275% misses. Gosh, and an 80, what was that? That was like an 88% miss. I hate this game sometimes, I really do. One's down. Looks like my sword is still singing, so that's good at least. Storehouse. More are coming. That voice. What was that? That voice. It doesn't sound like the urges. The urges don't give warnings. Careful. If we can hear it, perhaps it can hear us. They are coming. You are coming. They are coming. 
Like, are we gonna get attacked, or what's going on? Are you guys laughing at us? That's rude. You are swallowed by a chorus of turbulent music. Through one creature sing many voices. The harmony of an entire collective. Sovereign, he has come. He is here. The choir fades. A single melody rises above the others. Brassi and commanding. I am sovereign. You see a vision. Your lifeless body wrapped in fungal tendrils. The sovereign is threatening you. State your purpose. There we go. Fungal roots weave through your mind, seeking your true intent. Then the Sovereign drones a new melody, cautious but welcoming. Descend to me. Let us speak in flesh. The persistent music coaxes you forward. The Sovereign expects you. Visitor, you're a welcome sight, but let us observe the customs of the locals. The scholar's brow tenses. His voice spills into your skull, the spores connecting mind to mind. Blurg, proud member of the Society of Brilliance at your service. Or perhaps not. Your mind is far more complex than that of the fungi. <laughs> well, thank you for that. Your kind tend to be slaves down here. It's true that many of my brethren are enslaved here, but my intellect has secured my freedom. It is my hope that my research will lead to liberation and peace for my people. Such designs are part of why I've devoted myself to studying the Myconids. My colleagues and I are working to improve conditions in the Underdark. This need not be such a dire, hostile place. Our kind has suffered needlessly for generations. Do you also seek peace among the Myconids? This is where I belong, but right now I can't stay. I know the feeling well. What has driven you from home? That's none of your business. Uh, forgive me. Being inquisitive is in my nature. I've never heard of the Society of Brilliance. Understandable. We are small in number and rarely stay in one place for long. Research in the Underdark sounds like a dangerous prospect. Yes, but it has abundant natural resources. Spores, water orbs, Trillimac. I've studied them for years. Our peoples aren't exactly inclined to share with each other. And yet, we are all in need. Imagine what creativity would bloom if no craftsman starved. If every wizard had spell materials. Do you have anything interesting to trade? I do enjoy a good bargain. If anything in my private collection is to your liking. <laughs> 